what a magnificent performance, George. So very, very close. Yeah, I, I think, look, it's, it's absolutely gutting. I think the boys, they couldn't have done any more than they did tonight. They, they left it all out there and fought unbelievably hard. And, you know, look, after Newcastle away last week, we, we had some good chats this week and it was really important, again, minimum that all the people who travelled and watching at home that we set it out, that we, we love this team and we will play hard for this club. And um, We know the season hasn't been ideal this year and, and this group have had a lot thrown at them this season behind the scenes. It's, it's been hard for them. But that fight tonight was what we're all about. And um, it's very hard to swallow right now because, frankly, I think we were hard done by with a call at the end which gave them the pressure. And, um, you know, I don't moan often about things like that, but I think in a big game like this, that's, you know, there's got to be some accountability around that. But to hold them out the way they did at the end, that, that I've not seen that in a game in Larisel season, you know, and uh, we did rattle them. But um, unfortunately, yeah, it's not to be today. Just the same attitude showed in the victory at Bordeaux, in their faces, committed, ten, you know, you stuck in there, didn't you? You really did. Yeah, and, and the boys were brave. They were brave in the way they attacked the game. They, they smart, they boxed smart, you know, they made the right decisions and put pressure on them at the right times. And, um, you know, this, this is a serious outfit here. These are the European champions and, you know, the budgets are, are blow your mind, you know, in comparison. And, and I think tonight we just showed some proper grit played smart rugby and I'm, I'm absolutely devastated for everybody, all the players, staff, Gloucester supporters, I think we deserve to get through that round. What does this show this squad can do then, reports like this? Well I think it does and, and I think when you take into account some of the young 20 year olds who, you know, playing their first games in, in such big environments, it's, it's unbelievably positive and bright for the future and, you know, we've got a lot of big names sitting home watching that on the telly and you know maybe by the time they do come back they're going to have to fight really really hard to get themselves in the team again which is which is good news but uh, again it's it's tough to swallow right now because it's um you know i think i i believe the boys deserve that one yeah, you got an old head like billy 12 he did a real job for you again and what a game Sir Atkinson had against Jonathan Dunt. He was magnificent. His tackle rate was huge. Oh, I thought the physicality, all the boys showed, but Seb, as you say, man on man with, with one of France's best players. I thought the boys, you know, they, they dealt with Will Skelton, who's possibly the biggest rugby player I've seen. Um, you know, Aldry, none of these superstars were, were busting us on making line breaks. In fact, for, for big parts of the game, it was the other way around. So, um, you know, it, it's, it is what it is today. I, I, I can't really fault the boys and... Um, you know, we'll take some valuable, valuable experience from it. I'm, I'm not going to say lessons because you always learn lessons, but it's a, it's a valuable experience, and I'm sure there'll be lots of positives once we watch it back and um, get over this emotional part. And you had to reshape the side early on with two losses as well. Yeah, we did, and, and we loaded 6-2 because we knew it was going to be physical. Obviously, you, you're hedging your bets; your nine doesn't get injured that early. But I thought Chappers did a great job when he came on, managed the game brilliantly. Um, and like I say, I. I'm proud of the boys. Like they, they, they stuck into it today in a very, very tough place to come in, in pretty tough wind as well. And as I say, they were brave and fierce and, and everything I'd ever ask of them. Great contingent of Gloucester supporters here too. They enjoyed your commitment, your, your physicality. Yeah, outstanding support again, just like Bordeaux. And, and they were loud all game. And I say it's, it's really important. Everybody understands how important the club is to us. And, um, you know, these guys here, I think, we gave them a show. Unfortunately, no champagne, but um, yeah, I think they can uh, be proud of their team. Take this form back in the Prem now. Exactly, yeah. Well, that's, that's the thing, isn't it? We want to be like that every week, and uh, that's the challenge for the rest of the season.